Hey guys, quick video on how I made the background for this image. Uh, so let me go to ZBrush and um, it's pretty much it right here. Uh, so what you want to do is uh, grab a plane, make sure you have enough subdivisions, and uh, yeah, just start drawing out your shapes. And uh, I like to sharpen my masks, so Control Alt and then click, and just go to uh, your sub tool, extract, and uh, I like to set it to zero thickness. Extract, accept. That's pretty much the result. Um, so afterwards, you'll have a bunch of these shapes, and I like to uh, make sure they have uh, depth to them. The reason I do that is because uh, it gives it like a really nice shadowing effect. Uh, afterwards, I brought it into Marmoset, and these are the settings if you want to uh, copy copy them down and for this I gave the background its own separate lighting and the reason I did that is because uh, if I add the character with the background you can see that it's casting shadows uh, which I did not really like how it looked so yeah just uh, render them out to different passes, the background and the character. And uh, yeah, I just bring them into Photoshop. Uh, when you And when you uh, capture the image from uh, Photoshop, make sure you, uh, under settings, make sure you have transparency turned on for the uh, character. Uh, and it's, it's easier to place on top of the background if you do that. And then afterwards, it was just some color adjustments. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.